Hey, what's up IT pros? Today, I'm diving into something that can seriously streamline your workflow and save you a ton of headache, resource groups. Trust me, once you get the hang of these, you'll wonder how you ever manage without them. First off, let's break down what a resource group actually is. Think of it as a container that holds related resources for an application. Whether you're dealing with virtual machines, storage accounts, or databases, you can manage them all together in one tidy package. So why are resource groups such a game changer? For starters, they simplify management. Imagine not having to jump between different services to monitor and maintain your resources. With resource groups, you can perform bulk actions like deploying, updating, or deleting resources all at once. It's like having a master control panel for your entire infrastructure. Now, let's talk about cost management. By grouping your resources, you can get a clearer picture of your spending. You can even apply tags to track costs by project, department, or any other category you want. This is super useful when you're trying to optimize your budget and avoid any nasty surprises on your bill. Another big win is enhanced security. With resource groups, you can set role-based access control or RBAC to define who has access to what. This minimizes the risk of unauthorized access and makes sure that only the right people can make changes. But wait, there's more. Resource groups also improve automation. You can use templates to deploy and manage resources consistently across different environments. This means fewer errors and more time to focus on the fun stuff, like innovating and solving complex problems. So there you have it. Resource groups aren't just another buzzword. They're a powerful tool that can make your life a whole lot easier. If you haven't started using them yet, now's the time. Thanks for tuning in and don't forget to hit that like button if you found this helpful. Catch you in the next one. Stay awesome.